Hello everyone, welcome to the IchimokuCharts.com daily analysis for the S&P 500 for Thursday, April 16th. Well, the market did what we expected to do, it to do today. Yesterday we were discussing the green line here, which is known as the Tenkinsen or the turning line, which is the faster line, and we've shown over the last week how that's acted as support or resistance. We can see here on this occasion, as the market was trending down, that it held as resistance. You can see that it's held as support for the uptrend, the current second time frame uptrend that we're in, on three other occasions. Here, it's acted as support, a rough area of support, an area of support here combined with the top of the cloud, and here, for the fourth time, it's acted as support. So this line is very, very important to the S&P 500. Now, this line, the Tenkan Sen, tends to act as support or resistance when there's a fast move in the market. And we do have quite a strong second time frame uptrend that's building up quite a lot of momentum. Now, what we'd expect to see is for this line to hold again if the market does retrace. Now, we can see that we took out the previous swing high as well, which is quite bullish for this market. We made a new high, high and high low, which means that we uh, have a new first time frame uptrend as well. The configuration of the candle is looking nice. It's a green candle, which means that it's essentially bullish. And the size of the body of the candle is fairly large. It's not a small body candle, as we saw here. It's a fairly large candle. The only thing is that it's marginally smaller than the size of the body on the previous day, but really it's only negligible so I don't think there's too much to worry about. So importantly the configuration of the Kijun Sen and Tenkan Sen means that the market is bullish. We're now trading up above the cloud which means the market's bullish. The only worry that we have for this market now are these areas of resistance. <coughs> so we have an area of resistance up here at roughly 873 which the market will interact with over the next day. We want to see the market break out strongly above there. And whether it does or not, it remains to be seen. It could trade up there and trade off. We'll see. If the market does trade up through 873, we then have resistance up around the 943 area, which is a fair way away. So a very important day for the market tomorrow. If the market does trade off, as I said, look for the Tenkan Sen here to act as support. Importantly, look to the low of the latest candle. Uh, if that low is taken out, then we might start to see momentum coming off to a degree. But I think this market will trade up to around this level and perhaps take it out. Mm -hmm.